So now that I've purchased an external microphone and finally figured out how to use it, <laughs> I am super excited to create more videos. And I thought that this video would be about one of my most favorite accessories for my camera. It is the Matador camera base layer right here. And I purchased it because I wanted a camera case that I could easily store and pack whenever we travel, but that would also give my camera adequate um, protection. So again, this is the Matador camera base layer. The outside, the shell, is actually synthetic fill, so it is poofy. And it is um, beautifully made. It has the pull tab right here that makes it easy to take it off of the camera. Just pull it down from with the, with the camera inside and just pull it down and it comes off easily. To make it more weatherproof, there is a rain cover attached to it on the back right here on the bottom um, back of the case. It's this blue thing right here. And again, it is attached so you'll never lose it. It is well attached right there. And so you just roll it out. And roll it up over the bag. And with the camera inside, you can just roll it with the roll top um, enclosing here. Just roll it down. And it has a buckle that easily locks. So it's well protected from the elements. If, and I've, again, I've had this um, base layer for about a year now. And I've used it in rain. I've used it in Switzerland and the Alps. And it really gives my camera enough protection. And I usually just stuff it in. But I'll try to do it nicely this time. Roll it in. So on the side there are slits because it does fit a bunch of different sized cameras. And so the sides really give you room for your straps too. So even if you have a larger camera it still has the slits um, still gives you room for your straps. So the straps just go on the sides here and then you can roll it back down and again the buckle locks. So because I love this I purchased another base layer from Matador. It is the lens base layer. It's this one right here. It looks similar to the camera base layer but it does not have the slits on the side because you usually don't have straps for your lenses. And it is a little bit poofier. It does have more cushion to really protect your lenses. And the outside seems a little bit more weatherproof. The outside material seems to be a little bit more weatherproof than the camera base layer. And also it says on the label that the inside is made of waterproof lining. It's not meant to be sub um, submerged but it does give you the weatherproofing you need if you're out there and it starts raining. And similar to the camera base layer, it has the, the tab here that makes it easy to slide off from the lenses. And it also is a roll top enclosure with the buckle. So just roll it down and the buckle right there. My camera is a Fuji X-T20. And I have three different lenses. I have a 23 millimeter f2, I have a 35 millimeter f2, and I have the kit lens that came with the camera, the 18 to 55 millimeter f2.8 to 4. And so they are fairly small in size. So I can put both of these in here, and I always have one lens attached to my camera so I usually only have two lenses that aren't attached to my to anything so I put both in there and because they are a little bit tinier there is room in here that um, that makes it want to bounce around 
So you have to make sure that you roll the bag down, all the way down, to keep it a little bit tighter. Then when I store this in my backpack, in my wandered backpack, I still put the Velcro um, padding on the side just to keep them more stable, so to hold them together that way. Then they won't bounce around in the backpack at all. So you can hang this on your belt or your backpack if you want easy access to your lenses. And so my camera base layer, I typically, if I don't need to bring my backpack with all my gear, I would just use this, put my camera in here, and have the straps coming out on both sides, and I just use it like a purse. And a lot of people actually mistake it as a purse because it doesn't look like a camera bag, especially when this is stuffed in there. <laughs> But yeah, so I just use it as a purse whenever I walk around town and not need all of my other stuff. And I leave my backpack in the car. And so it's a lightweight way to carry your camera around and be a little bit more inconspicuous because it is a very sleek design. Expect more video reviews from me because I do have more stuff that I would like to review and share with you in case um, some of you are looking for different camera accessories, especially for travel. Like these ones, I love them because if they're not in use, I can just stuff them in my bag, roll them down, stuff them in my bag. They're very lightweight. So they're easy to pack, easy to travel with. And they, again, they do give enough um, protection for your camera and for your lenses. So there you have it.